Greetings, life dancers. It's a magic Monday, and today I just want to say hello and congratulations, USA. Yes, I am so happy, grateful, and blessed to be here making history in the United States of America. And I just want to say thank you, Joe Biden, for picking your running mate uh, and Vice President elect Kamala Harris. Howard University alumnus like me and my spouse, <laughs> we were in the same graduating class. I think I told you that of 1986. And although I did not know our vice president elect personally, I personally do know what the heck we all were doing at Howard University campus on the yard on Fridays at 12 noon. And that was when the actual step show would occur and everyone would flock to the yard, to the yard, we bison. And we would watch the step show of all of the uh, sorors and, and uh, fraternities. And so I'm pretty sure I watched uh, Kamala Harris, Senator Kamala Harris, now Vice President-elect Kamala Harris, walk with her sisters from the Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated, along with the Delta Sigma Thetas, the Q Psi Phi's, the A Phi A's, the Sigmas, the Zetas. Who else did I forget? <laughs> and we enjoyed that every Friday. So I'm sure I watched her. I'm sure I watched her as she crossed the burning sands um, into uh, on the line. And you, you guys that do the sorority thing, you know what I'm talking about. I did I Fi Independent, but that's okay. I was on the yard watching y'all and loving all the songs, loving the steps, loving the pink and the green and the red and the white and the blue and the white and the black and the gold and the purple and the gold and the blue and the white. <laughs> Loved it. So I just want to say congratulations. And all of you that ha don't know where the Howard University is, it's in Washington, D.C. I was pinned a nurse on those stairs going to uh, the chemistry building and down the stairs. I was also married at the Andrew Rankin uh, Chapel. So, and my son's name in it is Andrew. Hmm, what a coincidence. So with all that said, um, I am just very happy. And here I am in California. There are no accidents. Kamala Harris was San Francisco's Attorney General and also Cal the state of California's Attorney General. And I did vote for her then. <laughs> and I'm not ashamed to say it. And I'm going to sing it through the rooftops. And such a role model. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll leave you with a little clip of her speech from Saturday afternoon. And I just... I'm excited. So like, subscribe, and share. If you haven't seen me, I want to thank you, thank the Happiness Now channel, Rob Chana, for in for interviewing me. And that was on Friday on his channel, Happiness Now. I'll drop the link below. And yeah, lots happening. I have many events coming up that I would love to share with you. So please hit me up if you're in interested in healthy lifestyle and how to how to feel good about your life in this difficult time. So thank you so much. This was a quick one and I will be seeing you on a fantastic Friday, Magic Monday. The magic did happen. Thank you for all of the sisters for Biden Harris on Facebook. Thank you for my for giving me comments and likes on my post that I had 1.4 thousand people look at and um, comment about where I was saying that words have power and that we're gonna claim the victory. And so I just wanna say thank you to all of those sisters for O Biden. For O Biden. <laughs> sisters for Joe Biden. <laughs> all right, I love you guys. Take care. We're, let the healing begin. Ashe. Experience of loss gives him a sense of purpose that will help us as a nation reclaim our own sense of purpose. And a man with a big heart who loves with abandon. It's his love for Jill, who will be an incredible first lady. It's his love for Hunter and Ash.
Ashley and his grandchildren and the entire Biden family. And while I first knew Joe as vice president, I really got to know him as the father who loved Bo, my dear friend who we remember here today. And to my husband, Doug, children, Cole and Ella and my sister Maya and our whole family. I love you all more than I can ever express. We are so grateful to Joe and Jill for welcoming our family into theirs on this incredible journey. And to the woman most responsible for my presence here today, my mother, Shamala Gopalan Harris, who is always in our hearts. When she came here from India at the age of 19, she maybe um, didn't quite imagine this moment, but she believed so deeply in an America where a moment like this is possible. And so I am thinking about her and about the generations of women, black women, <laughs> for equality and liberty and justice for all.